We start our trip up Williamson and Tyndall at the Sims Creek Trailhead. Trailhead's about 6,300 feet and it's a long way to the pass at over 12,000. Adding to the elevation gain is the climb over the saddle between Sims and Shepherd Creeks where you drop 500 feet. So we sometimes break the approach into two days, spending a night at Anvil Camp at over 9,000 feet. The final part of the route, up to Shepherd's Pass, is over a trail that hasn't been maintained in years. There's often snow on it, it's rough going, and it's at 12,000 feet. The North Arete on Mount Tyndall is probably one of the best third, fourth class ridges anywhere. The rock's great, it's not too long, the scenery and setting is wonderful. This is super nice rock. It is. Yep. The approach of the West Ridge starts by dropping into Williamson Bowl and the beautiful lakes right below the east face of Tyndall. From here you carry on up over talus, snow and rock to gain the west face proper. All right. How's it going, Linda? Pretty good. <laughs> you think? The hardest part of the west face route is the final section just below the summit plateau. It's about 100 feet of easy fifth class climbing up a deep chimney. Linda, what do you reckon? I like it. How about you, SP? It's easier than the rock. That's for sure. The rock's good for up. Way to go down.